One lesson learned after the first season of the college football playoff is that strength of schedule is very important to the selection committee. Baylor apparently still hasn't gotten that memo. The Bears have one FCS school on their schedule every year through 2019. The only non-conference opponent that they have during that span from a Power 5 conference is Duke. So with opponents like Liberty and Northwestern State and Lamar on their schedule, Baylor has zero margin for error when it comes to the Big 12 schedule. I would think that they have to go undefeated in order to sneak into the top four if they continue to play those unherald unheralded non-conference opponents, especially when their Power 5 counterparts like the Big Ten and the Pac-12 have become really aggressive in their non-conference scheduling philosophy. The Pac-12 already has one of the toughest roads to the playoff, arguably the toughest road to the playoff, because it plays nine conference games and a league championship game. And then in the Big Ten, that conference is going to completely eliminate FCS opponents from its non-conference schedules. I spoke recently with Big 12 Commissioner Bob Bowlesby, and he said that the athletic directors have not yet ruled out the possibility of mandating certain types of schedules for their conference schools, but he does believe that scheduling philosophies should lie within the individual institutions. For ESPN.com, I'm Heather Dinich.